Alright, so hey, what's up guys, this is TPC, aka the Programming Cuber, and I have my first impressions of those two puzzles that I just unboxed, as you just saw. Actually, I unboxed them like a week and a half ago, but we're gonna ignore that. I was actually really sick, so I didn't want to strain my voice. Anyway, the this is the Tong Design Mayu 4x4 and the Moyu Boatrong 5x5. So, like I said, I've had these for about a week and a half now, and I actually haven't gotten much of a chance to do much with them. Um, all I've done is tension them, and I think lubricate it at least a little bit. I'm actually not completely sure if I lubed them both, but yeah, and also re-sticker them, but that's just, that's kind of arbitrary to the turning. So, yeah, um... We'll start with the Mayu 4x4, so I'm not actually not entirely sure if I have a batch 1 or a batch 2. If you guys didn't know, they had a whole thing where the batch 1 was horrible and then the batch 2 fixed it or something. Um, because I'm not getting much of that inner layer locking. As you can see, the inner layer seems to turn pretty freely without completely catching all the time, like a lot of people were having with their batch 1s. But it is still really sluggish in the middle as compared to the edges. It's just, it's super sluggish there. Um, so I'm really not sure if I have a batch 1 or a batch 2. And I'm not sure how to check. But yeah, so... And the reason I don't know, like, clearly is because I ordered this right on the threshold when the cubicle had the batch ones and then when they updated and said that the batch twos were in and by the way thank you to the cubicle for sending me these i usually say that at the beginning but you know this since this entire thing is kind of a weird style but yeah so it's pretty fast on the outer layers i actually really like the turning of the outer layer outer layers it's fast and it's smooth but the inner layers are so sluggish um, it's sort of like the Yushin, probably a little bit worse than the Yushin, um, but yeah, so the corner cutting, I mean, it's, I guess it's pretty decent for a 4x4. You do have these, uh, kind of corner cutting hole type things that kind of look like a maying sort of thing, although the corners are, seem to be fully rounded, not squared off, but yeah, I don't really have too much more to say on this. I still have to break it in, and we'll see if it gets any better. So for the Boatrong, uh, it is very smooth and pretty fast after I loosened it. It was super stiff. I don't know if you could tell in the unboxing. And so was the Mayu. But yeah, it's pretty fast and pretty smooth. All the layers seem to be turning the same. And I do feel that it is a bit more stable than the Yushin. Although I haven't broken it in yet. So I still feel that my Yushin is a little bit better. But I'm sure this will probably overtake it once I break it in a bit more. But yeah, I mean, I, I don't see any flaws with the Boatrong so far. Uh, corner cutting, I guess, is pretty good for a 5x5. Five five. I don't exactly know how to judge that. And yeah, so that's pretty much it on both of these. Um, so on the Mayu, I forgot to mention, I actually have had like two explosions, I think. The first one was definitely an explosion. I'm not really sure if the second one counts as an explosion or if it was just a pop, but they were pretty serious. The first one, it was a pain to get it back together, and the second one too. But uh, the Boatrong, I haven't really had any problems with the severe 5x5 lockups, which looks like you can force, but actually doesn't really happen in solves. But yeah, and I, I haven't had it pop either. So the reason I got these in teal, if you guys haven't kept up with my Instagram or if you don't have an Instagram and you just never saw, is because I now have a full teal 2 through 5 collection. Uh, it's Moyu, Guoguan, Tsung's Design, and then Moyu. But they're all branches of Moyu because Moyu is the only company that does this teal thing. I think... The teal looks really, really nice. I don't know why, I just really like the look of teal. But, yeah, so, this is kind of cool. And anyway, that's about it, I think. Thanks for watching. Uh, like, let me know if you actually like that unboxing style better than my usual style. I did it out of necessity, I guess you could say, because my voice wasn't really working too well. And I was pretty sick and tired. But, let me know if you actually want me to just do that as my regular style. So that's about it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video.